Welcome to this video on Landlord Go. So I started playing this game yesterday and I'm at level 15 as you can see right now and I own about uh, about 7 million worth of properties. And let's just go through this game first, what it is actually. So it's a game where you can buy real estate, where you can buy properties on your real map. So if I go in here on this left icon, I can see that I'm on my map and I can look for properties on this map. So let's just go with the leaderboard first. And if you go in here, you can see the leaderboard and let's go with the world. So you can see the one at the top is at 1.4 trillion dollars. That's what he his properties are worth right now. So what we're going to try to do is in this series of videos is try to get into the top 10. And for that, we need at least 70 trillion dollars worth of properties and right now as you can see we are only at 7 million so let's just first collect the cash that we have uh, that we have generated through our properties and let's just click on the collect so we have now about half a million dollars in our bank and properties worth about 7 million and the properties that we hold are these five properties uh, which generate around I guess around two million per day in profit for us and since we are having a lot of properties of the yellow color which if you go in over here is food the category food and this property here that I'm really interested in is orange colored and this is a uh, shop or service right so let's just go ahead and buy something or Maybe just, you know, uh, maybe extend the number of shares we have for the current property. So as you can see, if you go in over here, you can see Hotel Abiruchi, where I have 984 shares of this hotel. And if I go in over here, only 16 of those are available on the market. So in total, there are a thousand shares to this property. And if I invest 71,000 in it right now, I own all the shares for this property. So I'm just going to buy that. And if you go to the portfolio now, it's going to take seven minutes to sign the contract and all of that stuff. And then let's just go ahead and see if there's another property that we need to buy. Okay, this is a Purwa Pure Veg restaurant. And I hold about 500 shares of this property and we can buy another 500 shares of this property to own the property completely. But I don't think I'm seeing that property here, even if I have my agent turned on. I don't think I'm seeing that property here and that's because I had recently moved my agent from one location to other and I did it for like two times or three times I don't remember and that's why this property is no more available on my current location or on the location that I was in the previous so if you turn off your agent you can see properties from your previous location or your home location and if you turn off on the agent you'll see the properties from where the agent is right now so i'm in mumbai right now the agent is in mumbai and we have these properties around the agent over there but we don't see our hotel so i'll have to move the agent again to the previous location to see that property which is a purva pure veg restaurant and after that i could be able to buy it but just for now let's just uh, buy something in mumbai maybe something that has Let's see, this Cafe Coffee Day has 574 outstanding shares, but I can only buy 313. And the other shareholder is this guy over here who has 526 shares. So if we buy the 574, we actually become the, uh, the primary or the uh, most valued shareholder of the company or of the property. But let's just see if we can buy something completely. Let's say Butterfly Cafe is valued at 1.1 million and there's no shareholder so maybe we can buy this property or maybe this is eight level two property i can tell because there's a number two over here at the top of the property and all the others only have one so this is a level two property with 1500 shares outstanding and a valuation of 3.4 where there's no shareholder so there's tons of properties now this over here the hr college canteen is at 3500 shares and a valuation of 3.9 million uh let's see if we want to buy something maybe subway i don't know 
let's see uh, well about 4.5 million and we only get 313 shares of this subway right over here let's just see and the category is now I do want to buy this uh, more shares of this so maybe let's find that property if it's in there let's go to the orange color and let's turn off the agent I don't think that's gonna be there because it was on a previous location and it's not there so maybe let's buy this so I can take dry cleaner somebody's holding 52 shares of this property and we can buy 742 shares of this property for the money that we have right now so I think that's a good deal but let's just see if there's something else we can buy more nah we will only be getting 14 shares with this one we only get 78 and with HFC Bank it's a 122 million property so we only get two shares of that property so I think let's just get Venkatesh try cleaners and maybe we'll bargain with this guy later and get all of his shares as well so we're gonna get 742 shares of this property I'm just gonna hit buy here and that's gonna take another one hours and 47 minutes one hour 47 minutes for that property to be claimed so right now the most expensive property that we own is 4.5 million is hotel is hotel Abiruchi and all the other properties that we own aren't even in the million maybe this new Banaras dairy farm is 1 million and if you have to upgrade this it's gonna cost me 1.3 million which we don't have right now we only have 398 dollars left let's go to our profile and let's see okay I just got leveled up and I need 623k to get to the next level and let's just go to this section here and maybe uh, maybe just you know time reduction so let's just maybe get this guy so our time redu time reduces so this time that it takes to finish the properties will reduced will be reduced with this accountant by about another one percent or maybe we can look at mm, perhaps I don't think I need anything else right now I mean the revenue is pretty good at about two million a day and the slots available are also pretty good I mean we aren't buying many properties so only two of these slots are being used right now if you go into the lawyer we have three slots available right now so I don't think we need another slot most importantly we need the accountant to reduce the time but if even if you buy the counter now it won't affect the current properties that are being run uh, current properties that are being paperwork it will only affect the properties that we'll be buying after we get the accountant so uh, that's a mistake we made we should have first gotten the accountant and then gone into this stuff right over here so I think what we can do what else can we do well I don't know maybe let's just get the counter anyway okay and let's just get him again and we only have six left where we need 10 so if we go in over here maybe we can watch ads yes we can watch ads to get coins so let's just watch ads to get coins all right so we are finished with watching all the ads and now we have 14 coins so let's just put that into accountant as well 10 coins for the accountant and we have six more left so maybe uh, the lawyer costs 20 something else perhaps this one here this guy costs five dollars five coins sorry and maybe something else let's see this one costs five as well okay so let's maybe get into this increase the total uh, total valuation of our properties or total valuation of our empire or maybe increase the revenue I'm, I'm still confused about both of those let's get the increase the valuation of the property and um, five coins for that so we have increased the valuation by two percent if you go back to your profile now our valuation is at 7.5 million and we only need 476 
before we needed 623 if I recall correctly so I think even if we go to the auction center we don't have money to do anything right now and maybe the only thing we can do is wait for these shares to be bought and more revenue to be generated so we can spend on stuff the next collection is in four minutes and maybe i would like to move my okay this property has come up here again i wasn't available just right now but it's now available and there are 978 shares that are outstanding for this property and i'm really interested in it because it's a jewelry store and i just like that i like jewelry stores so uh i could have bought this with the 395 we had but this property wasn't showing up for some reason now it's showing up so maybe we can't buy that and let's see if our hotel apiruchi is showing up as well yeah it is showing up but we need something else i guess it was hotel apurva pure Veg restaurant so if apurva is showing up i don't think it is showing up nope it's not showing up even if we have our agent turned off it's not showing up let's go back to our shop and service and we have this over here it's showing up and 978 shares are outstanding so we'll eventually get this property it's a two-star property and we'll eventually get it so that's it for now in this video let's meet up next time in a new video if you like this video please subscribe to the channel like and share this video with your friends and if you like the idea of this journey that we are trying to achieve where we're going to uh, probably get to the top 10 in the world in the next i don't know one year or so it might take a lot of time because you know 70 million or 70 trillion is not a less amount of money to get into and these guys these are at 500 level 475 is the guy at the 10th rank and if you look at the top one he's at 549 so it would take a lot of time to get to these levels so i hope that you will enjoy this series and thank you for watching again please subscribe let's move on Let's meet up in the next video next time.